Welcome back, YouTube. This is Two Point Show coming at you with quite, quite a fascinating video. Today we're going to E5 Sherlock, and if you guys missed last time, we E5 um, E5 Amon Ra. So it's it's been a lot, a lot's been going on. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. It might be a longer video, but we're just going to discuss everything about him, kind of where people are suggesting the meta to go this and that so first of all we got 22 total how many do you think we're going to get my guess is one or zero sherlock um let's see i kind of want to do not all at once you know just on the off chance because we can get x amount of copies from him and then we'll be done so that was horrible i mean emily's all right um let's see six more yeah six is six is cool we'll leave it at that Augustine's uh, not too bad. We actually want Ormus, and I'm okay with that. So we got two more Ormus. Athag was not too bad. Rosa. Um, outside of that, I'm kind of I'm kind of fine on everything for now. Again, I don't really. I'm not gonna push Sea Land, so I don't really need Emily right now. Outside of that, I mean, Rosa's kind of in the same boat. Um, although, as you can see, I've had Daddy Ormus for so so long, uh, but. You know, we we basically I think we're all tapped out on this as well. Yeah, I'm not I mean I'm not gonna use any orbs. However, I figured if we had a shot, we might as well use it just to save relics. And again, I would recommend saving. Make sure to save, you know, if you want Russell, people are saying he'll be in the shop in two months. So keep that in mind. Um, but again, if you guys want to build Sherlock or Unimax or really anyone. It's your game, and I say go for it. I'm just really digging this guy, and I've liked him ever since he came out, but I knew it was smart to save for Anniversary, which is what I did. Because, I mean, look, now he he's here. We got five, and I think that's perfect. I believe so. However, um, you know, I'm not disappointed. I got four Russells in the bag right there. I got an E5 Drake. So it's not horrible. It's not it's not the worst. It just took me a little bit longer. And again, my server is not, you know, super, super hyper endgame active. Um, so there's that. First of all, we're going to swap Penny out, which I know some of you might be like, yo, you need Penny for Sealand. Again, I get that. Um, however, the next Sealand that I push probably won't be this. I don't have enough Emily copies. And on top of that, I really only would have an E1 penny. Of course, the hero's been locked. I will be right back. You guys probably won't even notice it. However, I will be back. Yeah, we still can't do this. All right, there we go. Um, so that should be everything that we need. However, anyways, as I was saying, I only have an E1 penny. I don't really have the food to be throwing at her. And then I'd have to make another one. Obviously, you know, I could probably make a Penny, a Sherlock, this and that in the meantime. Um, I figure I'm cool with this. And we'll just kind of see where we're at. There we go, looking good. We'll save this for later. I'm not going to worry too much about specific gearing or enables just yet. Um, as, you know, I kind of, I kind of want to test, you know, all of what I got against certain people. However, we'll gear them up kind of casual, take them into arena and see what is what. It always takes me a second to be like, who am I going to feed here and there? Um, just because, I don't know, I'm really weird on that aspect. Um, so real quick, actually, there was one thing. I think we're going to need that either way. Um, I don't know if we need any copies. However, it never really hurts to double check it. Still, we're going to have a whole row of E5 heroes, which I know some people have a whole sheet of V5 heroes. You know, still, it, it is very cool to see it. And I am very excited. I think Sherlock is one of the coolest people. And 
just just a heads up um he is getting nerfed or did get nerfed i haven't fully looked at it however i've seen pictures and this and that and maybe we can cover it in the future but guild tech just got upgraded so comment down below all right again sorry my computer froze as i was upgrading dragon slayer however as i was saying comment down below if you guys want and we can totally cover the new guild tech and all the changes that come with that there's a lot so you know if you guys are just questioning anything anything at all let me know down below and i would love to do that with you guys although we'll consider doing that all later all right so anyways one reason why everyone is kind of freaking out about sherlock his doves which again are not going to be as strong as they are um right now however his his doves he is some of the best cc in the game which like you know people who are running unimax are like well i built him for nothing sherlock is so much better and i get it on top of that he's got some amazing heals but it's not really you know a priest healer it's more of a self-sustain on his end and i think situationally it can be the best healing um we're not going to cover skills. If you guys missed that, feel free to go back. However, in a meta full of carries where they steal energy and they can do this and that, it's really, really good to be able to do multiple things at once. Because again, he can seal, but if he doesn't get that off, he, he can still heal. And that's huge. Not only that, he takes their HP. Um, so again, Sherlock has a very, very vast majority of, of skills um one of my favorite though is how cool he looks and you know i don't know he just makes so many more teams just a little bit better just because he adds so much um although again i'm not saying hey go build sherlock because i do think that he will be countered fairly quick just because the bigger influencers are like yo sherlock's amazing so many people are going to invest in tech so many people i'm assuming are going to get a tara to seal him off again that's just me and uh before you guys are like that's not the best setup i'm aware i don't have a ruby scepter um and i feel like hp hp is not too bad although I mean, attack, heal effect, HP, I don't know, that one might even be good on him. That sounds pretty decent, although his heal is based off of attack, and he doesn't really heal, I, I don't know, I guess, depending, depending on the team, that one's probably decent. But, one thing that I kind of want to test out, I don't know if I'll keep it, block sounds very interesting. Eh, HP, HP is good as well. However, block i wonder what the hp percentage is um but again i know you should run Rui. you should kind of run him speedy although i don't have that might as well try something that i do have the ability to do you know we could always throw augustus magic ball on him um the only problem is there's so many stones i don't even know what's what like i probably haven't saved them all block hp that's cool we lose eh, a little bit of hp but I'm fine with that. He's still kind of tanky, and he's got 60% reduced damage. That's not bad at all. Um, I don't really know. Again, you don't want him to be too, too tanky, because you kind of want him to proc that. Um, and before we fight random people, I guess we'll collect that. The thing that I'm kind of iffy about is I don't really know exactly who I want to fight. So we'll just get in here, find someone um that looks like a pretty well team pretty well put together team um screw it again i don't really really know who uh to trade out but i think something along the lines of this will be the team that i want again we probably won't win this one it is what it is um in fact odds are we're probably going to lose but this is the first fight i don't know how to gear him exactly 
pretty sure someone will let me know down below, although there's a chance that I've already found something that I like, but still, it never hurts, and if anyone has any questions down below, feel free, to just drop it down for him. Um, block might be horrible on him, but it might also be pretty fun, um, but either way, either way, I'm excited to test it out, and I don't know, I just, I'm, I like how it's not like, yo, build another carry, it's like, hey, you can build Sherlock, you can wait for Russell, in fact, you can even build Rogan. I mean, there's there's a few people that I've seen where he just works out. So that's that's always an option. There's so many different things to, to go for. And again, as you can see, that, that bird, if that person is left there, it can stay for 15 rounds, which is crazy. Um, but, you know, pairing that with so many other... I mean, Garud is dead, so we already lost. But, like, you know, you turn him into a bird, you slowly tick away, and then you have Garud to nuke down. It's pretty phenomenal. Again, I'm assuming we lost this. We don't have our, our heavy hitter. Um, but, again, it's just to mostly focus on Sherlock. And I don't know how I sounded like that, but I, like, froze for a second. Anyways, um, he was decent, again. You can see he just kind of ticks and slows things down just a little bit. We don't want to fight that. Um, this one seems fairly decent. Let's go for it. Same team. Again, we'll figure it, we'll figure it out as we go. However, um, let's throw Ada in there. Yeah, there we go. Again, I'll test it. I'll see what I like the most. Uh, but again, I just kind of want to show it and I kind of want to learn it as well. Sherlock can be phenomenal. I'm not telling you to build him. I'm not saying any of that. However, I'm just saying, if there's a hero that you want, go for it. And that's that's really it at the end of the day. Um, I just like him because my team is interesting. Um, I just feel like he can add a little bit more sustain. He can add a little bit CC to it. I think overall, I'm really going to like him. And I think that he can really help me. Uh, again, the bird is one of the biggest thing, and I feel like that's why most people want him. His CC is crazy. I love him for that sustainability. But again, he does both, so we really don't we we don't have to mind all that much. Um, this team might be a little bit I don't want to say weak, but just weaker. I notice Horace is in there. They got a penny. It's not like end end game, and that's okay. No no worries no worries. We'll still see what Sherlock does. But again, at the end of the day, he's basically at full health right now. And it's round four. Everything's going decent. He's been hit a few times, but that's that. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, I'm shocked that I had enough food. Again, he's not the best damage dealer, but again, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. He's not supposed to be though. You know, that's why you got Ada, Garuda, but anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you enjoyed me randomly talking. We're going to tackle Sealand. We're going to do some more stuff with him whenever we get the full hang of it. So anyways, guys, make sure to stay tuned for that and subscribe. And tell me who's your newest project down below. Can't wait to hear it. And I hope you all have a snazzy day. Peace.